So now that you're getting married and you will be married, what are you looking forward to the most? Um, well, honestly, like I feel like we've been on a roller coaster of like moving and dog and planning a wedding. So I'm looking forward to just like the calm and stability, hopefully, of marriage and like we're settled into our house and can just breathe <laughs> after this. And then kids, obviously. <laughs> How many? We both, well, we want three, potentially. Yeah. Boy or girl? At least two. Um, I, Andrew, like, actually wants a daughter. And I was like, Aww. that's surprising for a guy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But I, I always thought I was going to be, like, only a boy mom. I don't know why I have that gut feeling, but yeah. I just think it's going to happen. Um, yeah. What are you going to get your kid into first? Sorry, we're talking about kids. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, on Broadway. Oh my God. Soccer. Oh yeah, Andrew wants all the kids to play soccer. No football, even though we're in Texas. He's okay. like trying to avoid okay. that. Yeah. yeah, we'll see. We will never forget getting calls from Taylor after her team Zoom meetings, talking about this cute guy she was with. Um, she told us, they talked constantly during the workday and into the evenings. They would even FaceTime too eventually for hours on end. Um, whenever Taylor would talk about him, you could tell this was something different. You could tell this was just absolutely something special. Naturally, Alex and I were so intrigued and excited to meet this guy like we literally couldn't wait. He pulled up next to my apartment in Brooklyn and I tur we turned the corner and immediately knew that it must be them because Andrew was driving a nice ass car. <laughs> uh, which means that Taylor, you know, he's our, Andrew, you're already winning. Something that she gets from her father. <laughs> So the bond between a father and a daughter is an amazing and a miraculous thing. <laughs> Taylor and I have a special connection. I have been her protector, her playmate, her coach, sometimes her hero, and best of all, her daddy, which is my favorite and most important job. Look amazing. <laughs> I am so happy you have found your special person in Andrew. I know you are going to be an amazing wife because you are the perfect daughter. What I think Taylor loves mostly about Andrew is that he makes her smile, makes her laugh, he is her best friend, he's kind, he's loyal, and makes her feel safe and secure. Wow. Yeah. We're perfect. Yeah. Love, you. Love you. Andrew and Taylor are best friends. That makes me very happy. Tonight I'm not losing a daughter but I'm gaining a son. Taylor, we've been waiting for this day for what feels like forever. It's finally here. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Babes, beautiful. Like beautiful. Thank you. Andrew, we have been waiting for this moment for so long and we have gone through so much together that we really do deserve this perfect day to celebrate us. Oh my goodness, look at this. Wow, I love it, I love it. I, love it. I, I want you to know that you are so much more than anything I could have asked for in a husband. Sometimes it doesn't even feel real that you get to be mine forever. It's still so crazy to me when I think back on us and how everything came together from IMing at work all day to texting all day and FaceTiming all night. We, we made long distance feel like nothing. No one has ever made me laugh more or understand me and my weirdness better. I can't wait for all of our adventures to come. It's only the beginning. You make me whole, Taylor. You're my rock and my better half. I'm so proud of you and, and you continue to amaze me every day. Uh, your constant drive and ambition, taking on new challenges, nothing short of incredible and just inspiring. I love you, Taylor. Nothing feels better than this. I love you, your future wife. That's good. <laughs> Yes, you can. Yeah. You good to go? Mm -hmm. All right.
We are gathered here on this beautiful day to witness the union of Andrew and Taylor in holy matrimony. Marriage is one of life's greatest gifts. It's a blessing to make these promises with your soulmate. As you hold on to one another, you will find deeper levels of joy, happiness, and peace together. You too have the opportunity to build an amazing life together. You are blessed to share this experience with the loved ones gathered here to support you as you embark on this journey together. I, Andrew, give you Taylor. I, Taylor, give you Andrew. This ring as a symbol of my love. As I place it on your finger. I commit the whole of my heart and soul to you. I promise to cherish you. For the rest of my days. I give you all that I am. And accept all that you are. Friends and family, by the power vested in me, by the Universal Life Church, and by the state of Texas, <laughs> I am pleased to pronounce to you Andrew and Taylor as husband and wife. Andrew, you may now kiss the bride. Taylor, you look beautiful tonight. And Andrew, well, glad you can make it. Um, Andrew is both of our older brothers, and the benefit to being the younger brothers are we get to have the chance to learn from our brother. Andrew is basically like the rough draft for our lives. Andrew, we learned a lot from you over the years, and we'll continue to learn. Not just from you, but now from our new older sister, Taylor, um, and the beautiful relationship that you guys have and how you love and treat each other. We're so, we're so excited for both of you. Um, we love you both so much. Congratulations. And I think James and I both agree that, Andrew, you're a damn good rough draft. 